Well, hello. My name is Mr. Acton, and I teach seventh grade language arts. This is my seventh year teaching in Grandview and my 14th year teaching total, because I was in New Albany Middle School for several years before this. In addition to teaching seventh grade language arts in Grandview, I also coach the middle school cross country team with Coach Williamson. And I've had a lot of fun getting to see quite a few of you there each morning. And I'm looking forward to connecting with you in whatever form this school year takes, whether it be on Zoom or on the hybrid model where I see you in small groups at school and then you do some distance learning as well. I know this is a difficult time and a hard year in many ways, but I assure you, I am going to come alongside you and so will all of your seventh grade teachers to make sure that we make this year as positive, as productive, and as peaceful as we can possibly make it. So a couple of things about me. One, I'm a twin. I have an identical twin brother and he is also a teacher in Worthington. I have an older brother and a sister-in-law and a sweet nephew named John. I also have a dog named Scalp. He's an Australian Shepherd and he's about two and a half years old. And Scout was actually born deaf. And the cool thing about Scout is he knows sign language. He's a really sweet dog and a big important, important part of my life is my time spent not only with my dog and with my family, but also with my friends. And during the school year with my students. And like I said, I'm really looking forward to connecting with you in whatever form that might take. I also want you to know that I am here for you and here to help you in any way that I can. And I know other teachers have mentioned in their video there are three main guiding words that are going to help us throughout this year. The first one is patience. We're going to have patience for ourselves and for other people because a lot of us are learning to learn and teach in ways that we've never done before. The second word is that we are going to be forgiving and we're going to be forgiving of ourselves and of others because again, we're learning new things and we might make mistakes and we might mess up and we might say or do things that we wanna correct and that's okay. And then the final word is perseverance. We're gonna persevere, we're gonna keep going even when we don't feel like it, even when we might feel overwhelmed or unmotivated. And your teachers and I are gonna do our best to make sure that your class sessions, whether on the computer or in person, are engaging, are meaningful and are relevant to your life. So buckle up. It's going to be a great year. And like I said, we're going to be coming right alongside you to make it as positive as it can possibly be. I look forward to seeing you on Monday the 17th. Take care, seventh graders. Now get to work. I know I'm going to.